Good day, friends. It is me, HL Mod Tech, and I'm back once again with the Ortur Laser Master Pro 2. Friends, I have updated the settings I'm using for cutting cardboard, so I figured it's time to share. So let's get cracking. Alrighty, friends. So first, let's launch Lightburn. The first thing you'll notice is I have paid for it, so I no longer have that trial warning. Uh, it is so useful, I can't picture not having it. So I want to bring in my tiny jet. So let's hit open. And there it is ready for cutting. Now the setting I have changed. I have got a new on the orange setting that is speed of 2000 millimeters, power of 90. I left the minimum at 20 and I'm doing five passes. So that is my new adjustment on the settings. Friends, let's see how quickly we can cut out this jet. Of course, step one is to power on the laser. Let's hold that button for five seconds. And there is my laser on COM3. The first thing I want to do is I'm going to move it out. Once again, I'm going to hold shift so it nudges uh, 10 times as much as before. And then I'm going to set the height to the cardboard based on this part. You can see I've already got it aligned. We're going to do a different setting. I'm going to go from the middle. So that's why I've got this in a weird spot on the cardboard. Uh, this is going to be slick for circular projects. Watch this. When I do frame, it goes to the total edges it's going to hit. So if you're looking at your laser, it's always going from the center. So you can see that that fit perfectly. I'm going to go over and I'm going to go down to, and this time I'm going to do the round frame just because it's kind of fun to see how it's going to go around all the parts. That will still fit as well. So friends, I've got my glasses on. Let's hit start and see how fast we can cut out this tiny jet right here and now. All right, friends, so there you have it. It is done. I'm gonna hold down shift and move the laser out of the way. And let's see how well it cut out. <laughs> that, my friends, is buttery smooth. Once again, friends, this design was built so that the wing could slide through and then you can slide it forward or backward to find the perfect center of gravity for your flights. And when you're happy, you tape it in and then give it a test. And then you can keep adjusting it until you finally get the perfect flight characteristics for your tiny jet. So there you have it. Alrighty everybody, so here's what we got. When I'm using four millimeter cardboard, I'm now using a speed of 2000. I'm using 90% for the power, five passes, and it's cutting like a dream. Friends, if you enjoyed the video, please give it a like. If you got a question, comment, or a suggestion, add it down below. If you haven't subscribed yet, what are you waiting for? Smash that subscribe button, and last but not least, hit that notification bell if you wanna be the first to know when this brand new video from me, HL Mod Tech. Thanks for watching, have a great day.